Hi, this is Paul from TradeTheFifth.com and this is my stocks signals video for Wednesday the 27th of February. I'm going to be looking at a black box breakout signal today. I'm using the black box breakout indicator from TradeTheFifth.com on the Think or Swim platform. It's also available for NinjaTrader and TradeStation. Now EA is my uh, signal for today. Uh, it's on the daily time frame, so good earnings. We've had quite a long term bearish trend that we see seem to have found the bottom and seem to be moving away from and the catalyst is that earnings and that's what we need and as, as swing traders for stocks we, we're looking for that good earnings and that catalyst to break the trend uh, so let's have a closer look at this we have uh, a, I put in a resistance level up here at these pivots uh, as a potential target around about $121 but also we've got recent resistance as well at uh, this pivot here uh, that's come inside of this pivot so this is a resistance zone as well we have to be careful of so let's just zoom in a little bit and have a closer look so we had the lows from the bearish trend and then we started to move up towards earnings and then went very flat we had the gap down on earnings uh, then reaction was this is good let's put, close that gap and let's move higher so we've done that and what I really like on these types of setups here is a pullback against that earnings reaction so we have a big move up and then we have some profit taking to find support at the previous resistance level here this is really good and it's low volume so using our black box breakout indicator we can tell the volume for each day uh, whether it's low or high depending on the color of the candle so if we look at this really big green candle here that is obviously an update but with increased volume from the previous day that was an update but a gray candle then the following day we had some profit taking uh, red candle increased volume and then we consolidated with low volume so down days um, with low volume are cyan and up days with low volume are Great. So as you can see here, we had lower volume on three days on the trot. We had the gap up and then on this sell off here on this profit taking, we were low volume. And then at the bottom of this pivot point, something I teach in my core trading strategy is this rejection at high volume. So although it was a red candle, so we had a lower close than the open. It was increased volume and we rejected those lows which is a really really good sign uh, we can see on our multiple time frame dot cloud down at the bottom here on the sub charts we were all red that was all bearish and now we're starting to come on our multiple time frames from the daily the two daily the three day the four day the weekly we're going green this is good we're starting to build up some momentum in this potential trend reversal to the upside on EA so then yesterday we had increased volume to the upside so we had a contraction day in price action so the price action wasn't massive but we had a big increase in volume so we get that green candle and our black box breakout indicator because we've bounced off our EMA cloud gives us that signal so 10201 is the entry 9442 is the stop loss printed by our black box it's, it's automated but you see now the stop loss is below this wave two pivot here. Now, as far as Elliott wave concerns, we're really, really early on. So on a potential bullish trend, the only way we will see a wave three form is if we break this pivot here. And this could happen, but we want to get in early. We've got a potential resistance level, and I think this 121 is a good target level. Yes, we've got a breakthrough there, but let's give it a go. If this momentum continues, we should get enough force because we now had this higher support level to push through there. And that's how this trend sequence, this Elliott wave sequence starts to form and we can get in early. And there's, there's lots and lots of uh, trade journals in our blog that shows you just that. And I'm just about to do another one now on Cisco um, again. And that's at 250% plus profit uh, because we got in early on a black box breakout indication. So again, just to remind you, Entry long on EA on the daily time frame, 102.01. The stop loss, 92.42. Our initial target really is 121, but we have to be aware there could be weakness at this same level. But we would now presume that this, it's like a, it's like a, 
it's, it's contracted, it's come back at low volume, it's rejected on high volume at those lows, and now we're looking for that momentum to push through this recent resistance level. Okay, so that's it for today. Have a great trading day. Speak to you all tomorrow.